Hey, Collector, what's the deal? And happy birthday, Sagittarius. Because I really feel like you know this person left you to go be a bum or to be with the bum because they wanted control. They probably wanted someone on Section 8 that's never getting off of it. They want someone that will put up with their shit. And it's like, okay, that's fine. So, you know, this is the overall energy, observing emotions. Something's ending, something's new beginning. Okay. This person not a narcissist, even though they have narcissistic traits. They think they're going to get some wheel of fortune. I really feel like this person think they can come back with you uh, because y'all have a soul connection that it will come back together. But they're not putting in the work, so I don't get what they're thinking. I really feel like if they travel towards you, they haven't learned anything. This came in reverse. Well, are you prepared to learn from this love connection? They haven't learned anything. Proud community, what the fuck is up? Yeah, your guardian angels is protecting it. What's closed out for you now? What's closing out for you now? What new cycles are you ready to start? They're not going to be able to close out anything. You know, they want to have babies and shit with a bum. Then stay where you at. I really feel like this person don't get that you've been going in another direction. <laughs> Once again, friend, they'll be back. Are you ready to be recognized in... Uh, wait, are you ready to be recognized for your effort in achievements? <laughs> So they see that you are achieving things. Are you putting in the effort in your life? They want to be a part of it or now they want to give you attention. Are they still hating on that? That's why they're not learning anything. Yeah. Confession of what? That you are independent and you have self-realization? Confession that you do not want this relationship and you've been moved on. You've been going in a new direction. You're going to communicate to them. This person think that y'all will naturally get back together or they have all the time in the world. But we know luck is not just when you come across something. Luck is when you put in the hard work and it come out better than what you expected. So here is the right time. You don't even feel like you need to find strength within. You have it, friend. That's why you're going in a new direction. Maybe whoever they dealing with will be back. Well, if they be back, why are they feeling overwhelmed? Because you know about their sexuality. Or uh, they're feeling overwhelmed because they can't have sex with these people. That's a lot of people. That's 16 wands out here. For this person, this other earth. Excuse me, fire, wind, energy. 16, encourage and support. For what? A commitment? But they're not reviewing everything? These people got false dreams, crackhead dreams. Yeah, you moving on, this is a waste of time, or that's how your person feels. They're not letting things flow. And somebody's spying and being sneaky with you. Nah. People don't have a clue. Let's go to these other cards. Let's see what the romance angels want to tell you. This person's not that smart. 
if they think that they don't have to put in work with you, but think they could come back at you. And that's, especially after, you know, they've been having sex and doing whatever they want to do. And you, some of y'all haven't been having sex or some of y'all been just doing y'all own thing on your own while they're over there with the crash fucking dummy. Yeah, there's no passion. Came in reverse. When it comes to this Wheel of Fortune, there's no passion. I seen yesterday, this person is with a Ace of Pentacles, a Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Someone that's not capable of starting a business. Not what they, it's like, maybe, um... What the idea of a business is, it's really not a business. They have no trust in their fate. This water, earth, energy. I feel like with this sexuality, your garden angels is protecting your sexuality and you're going to communicate that with them. When I say that, like, to say you're not going to have sex with them knowing that they've been every fucking where and your body's more pure than theirs, even if you have been having sex. Th whoever they with cannot forgive and learn. <laughs> I feel like these people are going to get back with each other or they're still with each other. Yeah, past life relationship, you've known each other already. You're going to confess that you'd rather just be in, independent and you have self-realization. You're going the other way. You don't want them. <clears throat> they haven't put in any work and they're not learning anything. Huh. Yeah, wedding. What the hell was that just fell? Just the adapter. You about to me get married. We already talked about when you start going in a different direction, this person, whatever they want to do with you is not gonna be success. You gonna the angels gonna help you get married. You're getting married. I feel like you're getting married to a fire air energy or a water earth energy. Because that's what's been popping out. Separation. Apart from your partner is on the horizon. These, whoever they with is not reviewing everything when it comes to their heart and intellect. And your person is not learning shit. This person can't afford to be the man or woman in your life because of their mind frame or what they've been doing, they're comfortable doing. This person could be a dope dealer or this person could be just a loser. Yeah, go ahead and make a romantic just express your love. Ha! Huh. Communicate that when you're going in a d different direction. You know, you could tell this person that you cared about them or what they could have had with you. But they probably know it. But who gives a shit? I feel like with this wedding and separation, you're going to be able to express your love to your new person when you go in a different direction. I made some beans and rice. I love beans. With cabbage, I love cabbage, y'all. With some baked chicken and cornbread. That shit was so good. I'm ready to go eat some more. Calling in your soulmate. What did I tell you? This person gonna try to call you in, friend. When they try to travel or if they're watching this, it's like, don't fuck with the collective. You might as well go take several seats. Don't travel towards the collective if you haven't even learned the bullshit relationship you've already been in, friend. Look at those colors, prop community, LGBTQ, what the fuck is up? Like, don't even come this way. 
You haven't learned shit about your last relationship. You not learning shit about the collective. Unrequired love. This is why this person haven't contacted you. They're trying to use the same ethics or shit they were doing before and it don't work. So ignoring you <laughs> is a big fucking mistake. And them going back to this person steady, even acting like, it's kind of like, how dare you be okay with hurting an emperor, empress feelings, but you, but you don't want to hurt this bitch feelings you with. Or you, you'll hurt your God or your leader feelings, your ancestor feelings for a bomb ass bitch. Are you just protecting your own feelings because you have nowhere else to live? You rather be a bomb bitch than go be a bomb bitch. I channel uh two wrongs don't make a right. This person not getting it by Wycliffe. You ain't did shit wrong. You've been loyal to yourself. You've been doing things for yourself. You're not waiting on this person to please you and to give you money. You're not raising a kid. You're way more mature than this person thinks. That's why y'all not compatible. This is why you don't play the games they're playing. They're immature. So whoever they with is not reviewing everything when it comes to this commitment. But they think they're going to get married. <laughs> but they're making no effort. They came in reverse. What did I say? New love. Now it's the right time. You have you don't need to find strength with them. You're done with that, friend. <laughs> Your person been disconnecting with the world. Maybe they plan to get married. Who gives a shit? Let Roach and Rat get married. Or now your person, if they stuck with this person, they're going to have to marry them. Maybe that's what this comic wanted, but they not reviewing everything. When it comes to their heart and intellect with that one sword. Swords, intelligence, and heart. They're not very smart. And neither is your person, but they dumber than your person. Especially if they want to marry them or your person have nowhere to go. And this is what they want to do. Yeah. No love and gaslighting you. It's over. It's done. It's been done. Yeah. You don't hang with people you don't need to grow up. You're mature. So, you have a what? A Leo Aquarius that'll be back? Or air water, uh, air fire sign? Huh. Watching you? That'll be back? But they haven't forgiven and learned? So, these people might get back together and... Okay, so either one of them are learning anything, but they might be getting married. <laughs> are they going to watch you get married? Okay. Because I remember in the reading, she didn't want her friends, he didn't want his friends to help them when they was getting dumped and shit. So your person probably been hanging solo. Don't have to love and gas like these people because these people are not very smart. Yeah. They been a, a conspiracy. I told you. <laughs> I tried to put you in one. Yeah. You ain't worried about these hoes. There's some hoes in this house. There's some hoes in this house. When you see them pouring them out. I like them hoes. I like them hoes. 
I like them hoes. Yes, honey. You're going to get married when you go the other way. Uh, that you've been going the other fucking way. Ain't nothing new going to stop with them. They're not going to get successful with you. They can go hang by themselves. They can keep talking shit about you. They can stop talking shit about you. Who gives a fuck? They can hang by themselves. They can put you in a conspiracy. They can try to get with you. You don't have no passion for it, boo. In reverse. You like them hoes. I like them hoes. And shit starting in your life, bitch. You're going to be in karma. When you watching the collective get married. <laughs> ah, Star C came in reverse. Trigger came in reverse. This relationship is in reverse because they both, to me, this says both of them are not learning anything in their relationship. But they want to travel towards you. Trying to call in their soulmate. After they've been having their bodies with every time Dick and Sally fucking Sue. You don't want to see this person. You don't want to hear their voice. Nobody's putting in the effort over there. <laughs> but they want a commitment. But they ain't reviewed everything. And researched. So they don't really know what it takes to hold down a real marriage or relationship. You don't need no self-care. So what, this person probably said that you wanted your person to marry you? They ain't even a star seed. They don't know what the fuck they're talking about. This person calling you in because what they want to be creative with this purple. You see it's fading off. <laughs> so, uh. Yeah, that's bullshit. Yeah, whoever they with is triggered. Need to chill the fuck out. They steady trying to put you in the conspiracy, talk shit about you. That you, they, they looking stupid if you ask me. You don't need no fucking self-care. Yeah, you a threat over there? Or, right, hold up. Will your new love be a threat? Now it's the right time for the honey night, honey night. Huh? Will your new love be a new threat? A triple threat? Will y'all be a triple threat? <laughs> Holy shit. Let's see what was going on in the past. This person think y'all gonna get back together. They ain't learn shit. They partner don't know shit. And you've been going in a different direction. Yeah. Two, they've been keeping things a secret. With this high priest trying to pop out. So that was the problem. They were trying to keep you a secret. <laughs> Bitch, who you with? You should be keeping a secret. <laughs> But you didn't have kids with these people. You didn't fuck around and moved in and want to be a happy home with a bitch. Putting that you in a relationship all on Facebook and your social media. That's who you should have kept a secret. Not the collective, dummy. You been running your mouth to your friends and shit. Not knowing that, man, how would you not? How can you talk about the collective sex or anything with your friends or your brother or anybody, your stupid ass mom and dad, and not think they wasn't going to hate? That's how stupid this person is. They couldn't protect this relationship. They, they let people fuck it up. 
Well, go hang with those people. You can look stupid. Because I feel like eventually your person will, because they weak as fuck. They will go back and hang with the same people that fucked them up. Especially if this person then did prison time. They don't get shit. They don't get that. You got to separate to elevate. What is this red flag on no success? Because the garden angels, ancestors, going to make you feel fulfilled with the wedding. Or it's a red flag that's going on in their wedding or them getting married because they're not reviewing everything when it comes to heart and intellect with their sword. And your person not learning from their... Past connection. They're not learning shit. Yeah. Who's trying to stand they motherfucking corner? Stand their ground. Protective, defensive, maintaining control. Taking the high road. Sound like you. That's what you were doing in the past, and that's what you fucking doing now. Going in a new direction. You're not waiting on shit. Oh, this is the past energy. What well, high priestess then popped out? You have this bitch discover their true self. Things yet to be revealed. Yeah, they had secrets. You re you revealed this person's secrets. And they friend's secrets about how stupid they are. How dumb they mommy is. Looking like a big ass hamster. Some of them, they dad looking like a big ass roach rat. Got something to say. All the dumb shit they do say. Is why they fucked up. Or why they go through the bullshit. Yeah. Somebody putting in teamwork. Commitment. Building the success. Collaborating. But what's, that's what they were doing in the past. That's why conspiracy is out here. They still talking shit. Can't learn and forgive. So this karmic is around talking shit about your person. Secrets and talking shit. Knowing they gonna come back. <laughs> Because <clears throat> your person probably ain't got nowhere else to go. They'll eventually come back together. Rat and Roach is going to eventually have to be together and deal with it. Deal with it. Yeah, you taking action. <laughs> you ain't saying even fuck these people. You just know that they ain't about shit. Y'all are norms. Y'all are not nothing special. You could predict bullshit. What is this? Oh, dog, they want to grow up. That's what you make them do. Scorpio, Taurus, energy, water, earth. Grow the fuck up. Too immature to be with you. That's what you showed this hoe. Yeah. Tire moment. That's why they went through a separation in the first fucking place. You taught them how they need to fucking fix their sexuality. It was a burden on having sex with all these different people. Just nasty. These people, you was feeling vulnerable around these people. <laughs> and not knowing, you didn't need self-care. You was, okay, you expressed your love. You communicated. And then you went the other way. It's just that fucking simple. 
This person was acting selfish and ruthless. Premeditating, being malice about your success. About you being they soulmate, thought you was calling them in like you was supposed to do. And they were supposed to do, travel towards you. But no, they didn't learn shit from the last relationship. They wasn't reflecting love back with that six. Reflect. Like and subscribe and let me know if you want to do a reading. Yeah, burden again. They was, damn, this karmic been burdened. <laughs> Overwhelmed. What's else? Yep, take it for granted. Taking on too much. Obligation. That's what this karmic's doing. That's why they frustrated. They taking care of your person, which is like a fucking bum, but it's like, bitch, you a bum too. That's why y'all in the same energy. You want to be a mommy or a daddy to a grown ass person? And wonder why all you getting is hair, haircuts, and clothes, ho? After you wear that shit or show it off, now what? Now what? Collective, you getting your hair and shit done to go on job interviews. You getting your hair and nails done so you can go around people where it's going to make a difference. You know, be an example, a role model. These people just trying to show up and what? Go hang out on the corner, go get drunk and shit with your friends so they can hate you even more because y'all haters, so y'all hanging with haters. <laughs> For what? Wasting your money? Grown-ass people come with cars. Grown-ass people come with clothes. Okay. So they over there trying to be seductive and post their values on other people. What's that fire air sign? They thought it was the right time. To find new love because they looked at you as a triple threat. That's how they was trying to find strength within, trying to cheat or go find someone else to cheat on your person with. So they cheat on each other. <laughs> they come, they put each other in uh, entanglements. They put each other in. They like to compete with each other. They're not a team player. This is not a team. Your person got secrets. That they do on their own. Huh. Gay for pay. Ooh. And they really feeling this because they're not a narcissist. And I hope they help you to keep going, Sagittarius. Keep it going. What other cards can I pull? Yeah, your person feeling like they're at the end of their rope. <laughs> especially if this karmic want to get married. Oh, especially if this karmic is pregnant or they got someone pregnant doing things on their own. Ooh, revealing fear, deception. You find out the truth. Regaining, uh, pro uh, this is past energy. Regaining comp uh, comprehension. Compromising, regaining, compromise, compromise, What's that? composure, sorry y'all, I'm dyslexic, don't matter if I see the word or not, my brain just work differently, shit, you see things differently, I don't go by what I sound out, okay, so what, the Scorpio got a new job, so they think they gonna get some wheel of fortune, are they looking for one? Because they keep having with this karmic unwelcoming changes. Yeah. You were someone that didn't plan for tomorrow. You were just living your fucking life. Or you realized this person was a page. Yeah, I think that's what it is. 
a, un, a different, uninspired person. Yeah, this person was different from you. They was inspired. This was the past. This karmic was going through regret, fear, remorse, focus on the past. They was the subject of gossip. That's why all these ones are here. You were being generous, charity, giving, being valued, being well paid, support, employment, power, giving to charity, donations, the community. That's where you found your inner strength. And I hope they helped you, boo.